This is Minecraft Hide and Seek, but we're playing on a Christmas-themed map. It's so cold here, Sonny. It's snowing so much. That's because you didn't put on your sweater, dummy. Here, take this one. Oh, thanks, Sonny. And you viewers should get a cup of hot cocoa and cozy up this holiday hide and seek. Ho, ho, ho. Let's get coated. <laughs> Whoa, Steve, you're dressed up as Santa Claus. Yeah, boys, why don't you take a look at yourselves? Melon, you're dressed up as Santa Claus also. So are you, Sonny. Wait, what's going on here, Steve? I brought you guys here as Santa Clauses to find out who's going to take over for me this year. And I thought, who better than Sonny or Melon? The thing is, I can't pick between you two. So you're going to play hide and seek in the North Pole. Oh. Hold on a second, Sonny. That means oh, I'm gonna be oh, Santa oh. Claus. Uh, yeah, right, bro. I'll oh, become oh, Santa. Oh. Bro, are you kidding me? I'm already red and green. Christmas colors. You're just a beauty, yellow man. Hey, yo, that's not very Christmassy. <laughs> Let's do hide and seek. Oh, wait, this is way harder than I thought. Bro, you literally look like the Grinch. Bro, what are you talking about? I look cute and cuddly. Yeah, I don't know about that. Guys, this is Melon. This is the Grinch. Don't they kind of look the same? Comment down below who you think wore it better. The Grinch or Melon? And you know what, Sonny? The Grinch brought the best Christmas of all time. Did he? I'm pretty sure he almost lost everyone's presence and it was a disaster. Uh, I don't really remember the plot of the movie. But that's besides the point, Sonny. As the Santa man, I would allow you... The the duty of hiding first. Ooh, I get the honor? That's it. I'm out of here. Two minutes for me to hide, and then you're not finding me, and I'll be the winner of Christmas Hide and Seek. All right, Sonny. Good luck. Okay, guys. Here's the thing. I want to hide at this tree, and I have a super top secret location. All I'm gonna need is some goggles of true vision, which I have conveniently placed back here inside of this chest. Let's go. Goggles of true vision. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I also put a a couple of landmines and a trumpet. Put these on and check it out. The blue present here under this tree has some ghost blocks for me. Just gotta go inside and check out my hiding spot. But it's not done. I'm gonna take these landmines and I'm gonna place them all right around here like this and like that and like this and like that. So if that watermelon tries to find me here, he's gonna explode. That's pretty good. Now I go back to my hiding spot and play a little bit of music. Sonny, 15 seconds left. You can keep your 15 seconds. I'm already hiding. Ho, ho, ho. Sounds good, Sonny. Now, for Santa's first question. Are you perhaps hiding towards the center of the map or somewhere towards the outskirts? I would say I'm probably a little closer to the center. A little closer to the center, you say? Okay, fine. I'm a lot closer. A lot closer. Sir. Oh, that kind of makes me feel like you're smack dabarino in the center. Or maybe you're in one of these houses right here. Uh, I've got another question then. Sonny, are you perhaps hiding inside or outside? I'm wrapped up nice and cozy on the inside. Oh, you're on the inside. That means you're in one of these houses. Okay, you're not in this one, all right. Yeah, guys, it means I'm in one of those there houses for sure. Yep. Uh, okay. Okay, maybe this big house? Yeah, this would be a mega good hiding spot. There's lots of stairs, lots of places to hide. But you're not even here. Ugh, where are you, Sonny? <gasps> the Great Christmas Church. That must be where you are. Sonny, oh, Sonny. Bro, you are hiding so well, I don't understand. What is it you said again? Terminology you used on the second question. I said I'm wrapped up nice and cozy here. Here. Wrapped up nice and cozy. Wait, kind of like a present? No, no, who would hide inside of a gift? That'd be crazy. Bro, you can hide inside of a gift? That's insane. Ah! Why are there mines? <laughs> what if I just wanted to trick you into my minefield? Bruh, why? Why do you have mines? And by the way, there's only one present that's big enough to fit a player inside. No, there's a lot of presents that are quite large, I would argue. No, no. No, there's there's only one present that's three blocks high. Uh I found you, Sonny! Yeah! 
dying yet, bro. You were supposed to explode and actually die. Well, I did explode, but I tanked the hit because I am the Grinch. I mean, I'm Santa. Yo, you are the Grinch. Who else could survive a landmine? Um, Santa probably. Whatever. I'll keep a close eye on you in the next round because you got two minutes to hide. I'm out of here. <laughs> like I said, Melon, I'll keep a very close eye. Can you not just blatantly cheat? I'm just making sure you're not doing anything the Grinch would do. Yep, yep, I got you, yep. Ow! Called it. You're the Grinch. Guys, I need to hide in here. Something about it is calling to me. And Sonny found a secret already. That means there's gotta be more secrets on the map. And what better place to have a secret than in here? There's gotta be something around here somewhere. Like, ghost block, please. Come on. Oh, wait a second. He had goggles of true vision. Why don't I just do the same thing really quick? Yo, there is a ghost block. Let's go. I found my very own little cubby. And then at the end of this round, guys, I'm gonna ban goggles of true vision. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Let's do this. It's time for me to track you down and pour a cup of hot chocolate on your face. Oh yeah, Sonny, no more goggles of true vision. I banned them. Yeah, well, when you killed me, I lost my items anyways. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. Whoa. Deck the halls with bells of holly. This place looks awesome. It's the ultimate enchanting room. Isn't it, dude? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was pretty cool, but you weren't even in there. Yeah, totally wasn't in there. <laughs> Wait, why are you being so sus? Did I actually just guess the building you were hiding in? I don't know. Why don't you waste one of your questions? Fine. Are you hiding in the giant gingerbread house that has an enchanting table? It's kind of like a big church. Uh, yes, uh, I am actually. No way, bro. I'm actually so lucky. Oh, that's probably because I got that Santa Claus luck. Well, Sonny, I'm actually not in it. I lied. Okay, fine. Are you on it? Under it? What are you, what are you doing? I'm not on it either. So you're under it. All right, and you're out of questions. Bro, you literally told me your location. Now I just got to figure this out. It's got to be one of these things around here somewhere. Come on, one of these chairs. One of these chairs has got to have the reveal. Maybe there's a secret button or a lever. Maybe I should go ask Santa, Steve. Guys, this is worrying me a little bit. I put a block of... Oh, no, he's here. He's here. He's here. I've got to block myself off. Yo, I just fell into a hole, got goggles of true vision. This was a ghost block? Uh, no. Melon, I can smell you. Because you stink like poo in here. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Sonny. I don't know what you're talking about. That's interesting. Because I'm looking right at you. No, no, stop covering this up. You can't get away. You can't escape this. Stay away. No. Bro, that was actually a world record. I can't believe i found your spot that fast bro that's such bogus why did you fall down i was just walking around the enchanting table and i slipped oh, that is redonkulous sonny Whoa! Santa Steve, where'd you bring us? Well, boys, it looks like the hide and seek has been tied up one to one. So I thought I would change locations. This is the giant Christmas snow globe. Wait, a giant Christmas snow globe? This place is beautiful! And full of magic and power and splendor. Good luck hiding. I won't need luck, Santa Steve, because I have the power of Christmas on my side. Because I'm not the Grinch, unlike somebody. Dude, I'm red and green. That is Christmas colors. Uh, we've been over this. You literally look like the Grinch. Okay, I'm gonna go hide. <sighs> Steve, do I really look like the Grinch? Yeah, you kinda do. Dang it! But you don't have to steal Christmas. You can be the Grinch who loves Christmas. You're right. I'll be a good Grinch. Okay, goats, where should I hide? There's so many places, but I don't know the best spots. There's a lot of gifts. I could do that again and maybe use a giant landmine. Nah, I gotta figure out something else. Gotta be something around here somewhere. Ooh, looks like this this tree's got some presents underneath. Yo, Christmas bells, miniature Christmas trees, and ender pearls. Oh, those could come in handy. But I think I'm gonna take all of this and decorate the tree a little bit more for the holidays. Oh yeah, this looks nice. And then even put some miniature trees on the path. Yeah, that's more festive. And now that I've used all the decorations, let's find a top secret hiding spot. And I know just the place. I gotta get to the top of this giant Christmas tree. And all I have to do is use these ender pearls and climb up. Oh, there is no way Melon will find me up here. 
here. Ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Yep, I'm just working on my Santa Claus laugh because pretty soon I'll be in charge of the holidays. Just gotta win this hide and seek. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Oh, think about all the milk and cookies I'm gonna eat. Whoa, I am gonna be thick. Time's up, Sonny. And that means it's time for me to find you. Yeah, good luck with that. You're gonna need more than just the Christmas spirit to find me. Sonny, exactly. That's why I have three questions, dude. First of which being, are you inside or outside? I am hiding outside. Actually, inside, because we're inside of a giant snow globe. All right, whatever. I'm gonna take that as you're not actually hiding in the tree or a present or something of that sort. Yeah, sure. You take it however you want. Yes, I, I, I am. I'm taking it that way, okay? Now, Shunny, for my second question, what color block are you currently touching? Or can I ask this, actually? What is the block you're currently touching? Uh, smooth quartz block. Smooth quartz? Dang it, bro. That does not help me at all. Yeah, at two seconds ago, I was touching a snow block. Ah, oh, that's actually useless. Yeah, pretty much. All right, Sunny, you hiding at a place of high or low elevation? Uh, I would say high elevation. Guys, look, he's right down there. Bro, there's gotta be something around here somewhere. Dang it, dude, where are you? Hiding at a place of high elevation. Perhaps on the top of the tree, Sonny? Well, do I have to answer that? Is that even a question? Uh, yeah, you do. Well, I'm not at the top of the tree. But are you on the tree? Yes. Yes, and that was my fourth question. Let's go. Yeah, whatever, bro. You're gonna need to get Rudolph and all the reindeers if you wanna get up here. Wait, I can do that? Well, I mean, I, I was just saying, like, that's why it's not possible, because you're not Santa Claus yet, so you're not allowed to use the reindeer. Dang it, bro. I wish I could. I'd call on Prancer and Dancer and Rudolph, and then it would be over for you. But, Sonny, there are some weirdly suspiciously placed chests here, and if you got up there, I had to do it somehow. And in these chests, there are ender pearls! That's it, guys. I gotta make a getaway. I'm gonna hide on the very tree he got those ender pearls. Now it's time to climb! Let's go! Uh oh, Sonny, it's only a matter of time before I find you. Oh, no! He's climbing up the Christmas ornaments! He's gonna find Find me soon. It's over for you, Sonny. Guys, this was so ingenious to switch spots. There's no way he sees me now. Okay, I made it to the top, Sonny. I don't I don't even see you anywhere. Bro, you must be hiding somewhere lower on the tree. I guess you said you weren't at the tippy top. Yeah, I told you I'm not at the top. Heck, then where? Where are you? I'm hiding, bro, so that I win and get to become oh, the new oh, Santa. Oh. Bro, I don't see you anywhere. Maybe, perhaps, you're a bit lower than this, bro, but what the heck? How low did you go on this tree? You're out of questions. I don't have to answer that. I know, Sonny, I know. Oh, guys, I can see Melon way up there. <laughs> Look at him. Why is there an ornament that's moving down there? It's probably the snow. It's quite the blizzard in here. Yeah, let me just go investigate this. Uh, guys, why did I just hear Melon land? I swear I saw something a little suspicious! Dude, you only had 10 seconds, are you kidding me? Let's go! And now, Sonny, it's my turn to hide. Okay, no more ender pearls, bro. Those are banned. Clear at A. No more pearls. Fine, bro. I don't need pearls where I'm going. Alright, well, I'm gonna start counting. Now, you got a hundred seconds. Okay, guys. There's still a way I can hide in a creative place. Check this out. All I've got to do is hike up this candy cane and dig my way into the center. Sure, we might have banned goggles of true vision and everything, but if I can just get up here... Oh, bro, how am I supposed to get up there? I'm just gonna slowly, slowly break these bricks. Guys, bear with me. Bear with me. A any moment now. Any moment now. All right, I I've got to gotta break a few more. Just, just give me a second. Give me a second. Just a moment. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Just, just one final break, and, and we'll be good. We'll be good. And now, boys, my spot is complete. Complete. It's not the best spot ever, but maybe, just maybe, if there's a Christmas miracle, I could win! Alright, Sonny, I'm ready. Let's do this. For the final round of hide and seek, I'm suspicious that you're hiding. Let me think about it, let me think about it. Steve, did you see Melon anywhere? Yeah, I did, but I'm not going to tell you. That would be against the rules. Dang it, that's fair enough. Melon, I'm gonna ask my first question. Are you hiding, hmm, inside of a present? No. Okay, 
good. That removes a lot of the map. Now for my second question. Does your hiding spot involve a tree? Uh, define tree. Do I really have to explain to you what a tree is? It has wood, it has leaves, that's a tree. Okay, then no, I'm not hiding in a tree. All right, good, because that would have been cringe if you didn't know what a tree was. Wait, what is this? What is what? I just saw like a hole in the side of this candy cane. Um, 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 yo, no! Bro, and you were trying to cheese me and pretend this was a tree? Well, I mean, you know, like one could argue. How could one argue that a candy cane made of sugar is a tree? I, I don't know. It's it's growing out of the floor like a tree. You know what? I don't even know what to say to that. Just go talk to Steve. So, Steve, who gets to become Santa Claus? I had cooler hiding spots. Yeah, but I found him quicker. Well, actually, it's a draw, which means we will have two Santa Clauses. I think that's more in the spirit of the holidays anyways. The more, the merrier. You know what, Melon? I think Steve's right. The more, the merrier. So the more of you press that subscribe button, the merrier. Ho, ho, ho. Do it now. Or else I'll put a lump of coal in your stocking. So today in Minecraft, I accidentally unleashed a snowstorm and froze everything. Hey, this isn't so bad. It's like Christmas came early this year. Don't get too excited. We're getting attacked by the Snow Queen. Ah, goats help. Like the video right now to melt the Snow Queen. It worked. All the snow is melted. Ah, oh, man. I was kind of enjoying it. Ah, oh, good morning, world. It's a beautiful day in Minecraft. Right, Melon? Uh, I don't feel so good, Sonny. What's wrong, bro? You look so green today. Uh, this fire looks cold, bro. I feel so hot. Maybe I can cool down in this fire. Oh. Melon, this is why I warned you last night not to eat that poisonous potato. Oh, yeah. I think I need to go to Quandale, Sonny. Uh, I'm gonna die. I feel like I'm gonna die. Quandale, we have an emergency. It's Melon. He ate a poisonous potato and he's super sick. <laughs> See? Oh my, that sounds really bad. Head down to the scanner and we'll figure out what to do from there. Oh, Quandale, downstairs is over here, right? No, Melon, get away from the lava. It's over here. Come step on the pink elevator pads. Uh, do I go up or do I go down? Go down, bro. Oh. Uh, get in the scanner. Get in the scanner. Okay, I'm in the scanner, bro. Please help me. The scan is completed. Head back upstairs so we can check the results. Melon, quick, quick, upstairs. Quandale probably has the cure. Okay. Oh, I really don't want to be like this forever. Please tell me you have a cure, Quandale. You see that capsule over there? The one with the red glass. Get inside of that capsule, Melon, and we'll fix you up. Melon, jump in. I'll hit the switch. Yep, I'm right there, Sonny. <sighs> I'm right there. Are you feeling better yet? I just applied the medicine. Um, no, I still feel pretty sick. Oh, Sonny, I think, uh, I think, I think I'm feeling better now. Yeah, you're back to normal, bro. Okay, Melon, I'm glad you're feeling better, but come back downstairs. I saw something suspicious down here. Um, okay. What, these golden blocks? No, no, those look amazing, not suspicious. This section over here looks new. I've never seen this security laser system with a book and a chest. Yeah, Quandale's hiding something and I don't like it. Do not touch that. I repeat, do not touch. I set those lasers up specifically to stop you two dummies from doing any harm. Oh, Quandale. <laughs> My bad. We were just looking. We would never touch this stuff. Right, Melon? Yeah, Quandale. We would never touch this stuff. Okay, Melon. Let's get out of here. We'll sneak back in the lab later at night. Sonny, you won't touch this stuff, but I will. Sonny, it's nighttime, and that means it's time to break into Quandale's lab. Yes, I've got the pickaxe right here. I'm also gonna bring some food in case we get hungry. Yep, and I've got the flint and steel, and that should do the trick. Here's your food, Melon. Eat big to get big. Sonny, all day I've been devising a plan. I want you to hear me out. All right, hear my plan out, Sonny. I've got this flint and steel to start a fire to distract Bob, and then what I want you to do is go grab his giant machinery. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. Who the heck is Bob? Bob the Miner, bro. He's been our neighbor for five years. How do you not know who he is? Uh, that guy? But he doesn't live near Quandale. Just follow me, Sonny. Right behind you. Oh, 
Oh, that's Bob! Sonny, I'm gonna light his machine on fire to distract him. Doesn't that seem a bit evil? Why don't you just light the trees on fire and then he'll look at that? There's no choice, Sonny! I've gotta do this to distract Bob! And while he's distracted, I'll mine a secret passage into Quandale's lab! Melon, it worked! I think you've distracted Bob! Yo, Bob, what the heck happened to your uh, machine, bro? What have you done, Melon? You ruined my machine! I spent my entire life working on this. Psst, psst, Sonny, go, go. I'm digging. I'm digging. Secret tunnel. Melon, Melon, I'm in. Get down here. Uh, Bob, I'm sorry about all of this. It wasn't me. I swear it wasn't me. I'm out of here. Good luck. Ow. You made it. Now, how are we going to disable this security system? Uh, we probably should have come up with a plan for that. Wait a second. I've got a pickaxe. I'll just break these. Oh, wait. Never mind. You can't break these blocks here. Dude, Quandale has to have left a switch somewhere. Just keep looking for something. Okay, I'll keep my eyes out. Is this a secret button? Sonny, I know where it must be. The command block area. Maybe one of these command blocks triggers something. That's a great idea, Melon. Come on, one of these, one of these. Hey, I just slipped into a random hole. Sonny, what's down there, bro? Lasers on off switch. Oh, that's convenient. Flick. Uh, Melon, it looks like it disabled the top two. We're gonna have to make a jump over over this. Hiya! Yes! Now, Sonny, I'll take the chest, you look at the book. Whoa! There's crazy arctic armor in here, bro. It's awesome. Okay, and the book says, Dear Journal, today I stumbled upon the Snow Queen's secret base. It's quite intriguing and filled with fascinating loot. I haven't explored it yet, so everything inside remains unclaimed. Melon, we're gonna be rich! Yo, let's do this thing, bro! This is finally our ticket to have our awesome mansion! Yeah, but Melon, how are we supposed to get there to find all of this loot? Um, I don't know. There's some paper in here, but it just has gibberish numbers. Melon, those are the coordinates! Oh, yeah! I, I totally knew that. Yeah, let me grab my armor and swords, and it's time for us to head to the Arctic. And get looted! Uh... Sonny, I went too high. Quandale's still here. Oh, oh, that was close. Melon, this must be the place. The coordinates have led us all the way here. But what exactly is this? Uh, I believe it's some sort of Arctic cave, Sonny. I feel like there's gonna be a really scary monster down here, Melon. I don't like this. This doesn't perhaps feel like an Arctic cave. It feels a little bit more tropical, to be honest. Yeah, bro, this doesn't look very wintry. You're right. Yeah, I'm kind of getting hot. I'm gonna take uh, all these Arctic clothing's off. Oh, it is so wetty in here. Do, 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 do. Sonny, I bet you this base has awesome loot and it was super easy. I don't know why Quandale hasn't raided this himself yet. Probably just hasn't got around to it. Yep. Uh, Sonny? It's really cold in here and there's a snow queen! Quick! Get your armor back on! <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, my faithful followers. Have you come to pay homage and admire my glory? Uh, no. We came here to take all of the unclaimed loot. We were told there was a lot of treasure and riches here. How dare you speak such words in my presence? Do you know who I am? I am the Snow Queen. Prepare to face my fury as I unleash this relentless snowstorm upon you. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. At least let me take the loot! Oh, no! Ah! Sonny, what the heck happened and where are we? I don't know, no, Melon, but I'm cold. It's freezing! Yeah, Sonny, we gotta get out of here. They say ice is a good insulator, but I'm cold as heck right now. I know, bro, and I think there's a crazy blizzard out there. We've gotta make our way to the surface, though, and try and find our way back home. Yeah, at least we can break this ice easily with our pickaxe. That's true, and maybe at home we can start a nice fire, get some hot cocoa, make some marshmallows. It'll be cozy. Yeah, Sonny. Easier said than done. We're on the top of a giant snow mountain. Or is this a glacier? What if we're in the ocean? And who knows how far we are from home? I'm freezing. Bro, maybe we can ask this guy. He just ditched. He went invisible. But maybe his llamas know? Uh, hello, llamas. I'm looking for a way home. Ow! There's a stray! Melon, where are you? Die! Thank you. Yes, llamas. Uh, we're looking for a way home. Ta 
talk to me. Oh, don't you know? There's been an ice storm for seven days now. Everything is frozen. <laughs> Gross, he spat on me. That's what you two get for starting this mess. How is this us? Melon, follow me. I think I know the way back home, but stay close. There's limited visibility in this blizzard. Yeah, and there's so many strays, bro. What is this? Just ignore them. They're not that dangerous if we keep running. Sunny, dude. Wait, we made it. Our house. I told you I knew the way. Now follow me, Melon. Uh, bro, uh, a lot of our house is frosted over. Even our campfire. Now we can't stay warm in here. This is really bad. Dang it, bro. I've had enough of this nightmare. I just want to go to sleep and pretend none of this ever happened. Yes, our beds. They survive. <laughs> Melon, wake up, you doofus. Melon, wake up. Okay, okay, Sonny. I wasn't even really asleep. I've been so cold. Me too. I had chills in my bones. I think we're gonna have to come clean, though, and tell Quandale. Yeah, uh, hopefully he has a solution to fix this, Sonny. Let's go find everyone. Uh, Melon, we have a problem. Quandale's lab is frosted over, too. Dude, these stupid strays die. Hold on, let me see if he's inside. Yeah, hold on. I'm busting in. Uh, Melon? Quandale's missing! Dang it, bro. Where did everyone go? I don't know, bro. Let's go see if we can find Alex. Oh, her shop is starting to look pretty abandoned, Sonny. Hello? Alex? Are you here? We want to buy some hot chocolate. Sonny, she's not here, bro. Where is everyone? Wait, Melon. Let's go see if Bob's here. I, I don't know if we should go see Bob. I'm pretty sure he hates me. Yeah, I'll talk to him. Don't don't worry. Uh, Bob, are you here? Your tractor's not on fire anymore. Oh, no, guys. It looks like Bob went missing, too. Where the heck did everybody go? Yo, Sonny, I found something. You have to check this out. Okay, Melon, show me what you found. Follow me. Here it is, Sonny. This was never here before. Is it an igloo? What is this place? It does look like an igloo, and there's smoke coming from it, which means there's people inside. They've got a fire. Let's get in and stay warm. You gotta close the door behind Behind you, Melon. Don't let the cold air in. Okay, okay, okay. Our friends! It's Quandale, Alex, Bob, and... Wait, why is Steve here? Bro, Steve's always here. All right, I won't question it. Well, 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 who do we have here? I explicitly warned you two not to go behind the lasers. Did you even bother to read what was written in that book? Uh, yeah, Quandale, I read page one. You said there was this really awesome place with really awesome loot, and you didn't even steal it yet. So, yeah, we went to go take that loot. You darn fool, you didn't even read the second page? Oh, there was a second page? Let me check. Yo, Sonny, what does it say? Quandale's journal number two. It was a colossal mistake. The consequences are far too dire. Under no circumstances should I consider looting this place. The power within is malevolent and could plunge the entire world into eternal snow. Oh, my bad. Sonny, you idiot! How was I supposed to know there was a second page? Because it says page one of two. Oh, yeah. I just got distracted by the idea of really cool loot. Oh, Sonny, you're such an idiot. So, guys, how can we make this up to you? Right now, we must work together to save our world. I've pinpointed the Snow Queen's new location, and I left some armor and items for you. Oh, Quandale, thank you so much! Yo, we're swapping from Arctic to fire! Yes, Melon, I can feel the heat flowing through me. Yes, yes, I'm no longer cold all the time. Also, I've gathered some food for you. Please take everything. Yo, Sonny, this food is awesome! Awesome. Yo, give me this. You tried to steal. Oh, wait, no, I stole your golden apple. Sorry about that. Yeah, can I please have those back? Thank you. I helped Quandale in locating those coordinates and ensure the entrance is clear for you to access. Also, take these polar bear bikes. No way. Polar bear bikes? Dude, check this out. Yo, Steve, what do you have for us? A swift kick in the butt. Thank you, Steve. That was the most important thing anyone had to offer. Yeah, Melon, there's also this third chest with weapons, shields, bows, and stuff like that. I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Let me grab some of that, too. So, Quandale, what were those coordinates again? Head to 17071582 and good luck! Let's go! To defeat the queen! Melon, I think we finally made it. Check this place out. This looks like the Snow Queen's 
brings layers, sonny. It sure does. And our polar bears are too thick. It's kind of hard to travel. Yep, it's time. You've done me so well, Mr. Polar. I'm gonna miss you. Oh, Melon, you can just pick him back up. Oh, wait, really? Yeah. Oh, uh, well, I'll save you for later, Mr. Polar Bear. For now, it's time to do some parkour. I'm right behind you. We've got to make these jumps and save Minecraft. Yeah, Sonny, these jumps aren't that easy, though. Yeah, true. There's ladder parkour. Yuck. But I got this. It's nothing. hi uh, I'm in. Uh, hi Nice jumps. Couple more, Melon, and we'll be at the Ice Queen's lair. I can just tell. And let's go. Uh, Melon, we're inside of that glacier again. Uh, Sonny, I can feel her presence. She's close. Are you kidding me? We got more parkour? Yeah. It looks like it's getting more challenging, too. Uh, corner jump. Oh, uh, light to work. <laughs> Yeah, Sonny, I'm right. Dang it! Yeah, Melon, you really don't want to mess these jumps up. It kind of sucks. It's okay, Sonny. I've practically made it. Nicely done. But don't worry. There's lots more ladders here for you. Oh! Huh. Grabbed it. Making it. Let's go! Uh, Melon, this next zone. There's no blocks! Wait, what? How in the heck are we supposed to get across? I'm looking at the ceiling. Is there a pattern or something? Oh, wait. No, there's barriers. Oh, this looks easy. Oh, yeah. You, you just got to go here. And you made it. Oh, wow. It was it was that easy, huh? Sonny, I feel it. This button will lead to the Ice Queen. Uh, or not. I see some weird lights in the distance, though. Are these beacon lights? They look so frosted. Dude, is her cold so powerful? She can even freeze a beacon? No way, bro. That's not possible. Well, Sonny, we have no choice but to head towards them. Wait a second, Melon. What if these beacons are the source of her power, causing the eternal winter? Yo, they just might be. Yo, go away, zombies. We don't got time for you. Yeah, I'm gonna try and climb to the top of these beacons and see what's going on. Sonny, do you hear that? Something doesn't sound right. It sounds like ice crystals. Kill them, melon. Take them out. Actually, there's too many. There's so many spawners. I'm just gonna run, melon. Eating a cheeseburger and running. Ice bomb. Wait, that's a brilliant idea. And take out the spawners. Take them out. I, I was trying to ice bomb them. Ow. Oh, Sonny, you're hurting me. Oh, my bad. I'm just gonna leave you, Melon. <laughs> Good luck with that. Break these before they all spawn in. Come on. Yes, I destroyed all the spawners, Sonny. Ice bow. No, there's more. Hurry up. Wait, there's more? Oh, no. I need your help, dude. I'm trying to break these, but I can't fight and smash the spawners at the same time. Sonny. Sonny, wait for me. I'm almost there. Mel, we've got to break through this ice wall. Oh, that was really easy. Yeah, but now there's more spawners. Yo, just break them before they spawn in. It's that easy, Sonny. Oh, you're actually a genius. Yeah, it ain't that hard, bro. And Sonny, look out. There's a stray. I got this. I got this. I'll give him a taste of his own medicine. And bye. Melon, we're not there yet. We have to go higher. Bro, how much higher do we have to go? We've got to be close. I have no idea. Sonny, let's just ignore the spawners and keep going up. Yeah. Yeah, I'm with you on that. They're just slowing us down. It's getting a lot colder up here, though. My fiery armor is barely keeping me warm at this point. You're right, bro. At this altitude, the snow is building up so quickly. And this frost crystal monster, die! You are so annoying. And now you're dead. Um, Sonny, I don't know if this is where we're supposed to be. I just figured we had to go all the way up. Sonny, we must have missed something up here. Hold on. Uh, maybe we just needed to break the rest of the spawners. No, no, no. You're an idiot, bro. It's right here. We just completely missed this ice elevator. Oh, well, good news. I'm killing all of the ice crystals. I'm eating a cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. Mmm, cheeseburger. Mmm, cheeseburger. So, what did we miss? I'm coming back up. Oh, this thing. Yeah, now we go up. Look out, creeper. I'm with you. Wait, Melon, there's ice shards with levers in them. Hold on a second. Maybe we have to enable all of these levers to do something. I don't know. Maybe it'll depower the beacons? Kill the ice queen? I have no clue. Let's just keep our eye out for them. Uh, Sonny, I'm seeing some weird- Ah! Woo! 
Oh, that was close. I almost died. Um, Sonny, there seems to be something weirdly suspicious about the center. I don't think I want to go any closer. What the heck? Snow golems and the snow queen. Wait a second, Melon. We can't get to her. There's an invisible barrier shielding her. Dude, I think we have to disable these beacons. Melon, you're right. But I think the only way to do that is to activate each of these levers. You're right. Hold on. Let's test that theory, Sonny. Did you deactivate this one yet? Uh, no, maybe. I don't know. Well, Sonny, I can tell you it's active right now. I can see some redstone coming out of it. Time to disable! Melon? I think it actually worked! Yo! That's it. That's the key to defeating the Ice Queen. We just need to destroy five more of those. And disable! Come on, please get disabled. It's gone! This is it, Sonny. The final beam. Disable! Yo, it's gone! We actually did it! Sonny, it's time to take down the Snow Queen. I just hope that actually worked and the barriers are gone. Yeah, it definitely worked, Melon! The golems! Yo! We need to take them out. Sonny! Oh, they fell to their deaths. Yeah, those guys were not very smart, but she still has two more henchmen. I'm gonna handle this with my snow bombs! Yes! I'm destroying them! Die! Oh, wow. They actually sucked. Yeah. Take that, Snow Snow Queen, we've got way bigger brains than you. I must commend you for your triumph and actions. It's been ages since anyone has bested me. In recognition of your valor and victory, I shall spare your lives and return your world to its former state. Seriously, that was it? Yeah, your your henchmen kind of sucked. Wait, Melon! Melon, they're back! Yo, what the heck? How? I don't think they appreciated our trash talk. Shoot them off the edge. That was close. Uh, yeah, Snow Queen, we accept your offering. We'll leave now. Just turn the world back to normal, please. I will now say my magic spell. Snows, Stormus, Stopus, Gaiot. We're home! Uh, well, Sonny, the world's back to normal, but our house is completely ruined! On the bright side, it looks like a lot of the ice is thawing out. Yeah, Sonny, I would say that's not on the bright side because our entire house is soaked now. Goats, to help dry out our house, press the like button in the next two seconds. One, two. Uh, no, no! I didn't mean it not like this! No! Today in Minecraft, I'm having the most perfect dream ever. And I'm having a nightmare! Yup, such a perfect day. Nothing could go wrong. Help, please subscribe right now to save me. Yo, I caught a fish! Let's go! Melon, I'm so proud of you. Let me get one of these boys, too. Come on, give me a little slamming. I want another one for my bucket. Sonny, you are not a good fisherman. Yo, chill. Give it a second. The best fisherman is the most patient one. And turns out I'm gonna have to be very patient. Let's go! Your boy gets a rock card! And now, Melon, I'm gonna let my slamming live here forever. Aww. We've been working pretty hard, though, bro. I think we deserve a break. Why don't we bake a cake? I got the sugar and I got the wheat. You get the milk. Sounds good, bro. I was thinking the same thing. I want some cake with extra frosting and icing and sprinkles. Oh, let's go. And maybe some cherries on top. You bring the cherries, right? Uh, yeah, I got the cherries. Okay, cool. I got the milk buckets and let me borrow some eggs from our chickens. Never to be returned again. <laughs> Oh, wait, I, I wasted them all. I, I actually need one of these, though. There we go. Uh, Melon, where you at? Let's bake this cake, shall we? Yeah, come on in. Come on in. Uh, here you go. In the kitchen, bro. Crafting table's in the kitchen. Everybody knows that. Here's that and that and that and that. All right, all right. Give me the give me the buckets of milk. Yep, thank you, thank you. And that and that and that and that and that and that and that. And now it's time to craft our cake. Sugar, sugar. Why are you holding a puffer fish? Don't worry about it. Bang, bang, boom. And puffer fish cake. Oh, that's gross, Melon. What is your problem? Yes, I have a beautiful cake. That's disgusting. I told you to put cherries. Oh, is that puffer fish blood? Yuck, yuck. Ah! Just eat up, Sonny. It's good for you. Okay, fine. <laughs> I'm gonna eat the whole thing, Melon. Only one slice left. Come on, come on. I want it. I want it. Dibs, dibs, dibs. Yes, I'm hungry. There's only one more. There's only one more. 
If I can't have it, no one can. You know what? That's fine, because this cake was disgusting. Bro, whatever. I am stuffed! I'm gonna go to bed. I'm super tired right now. You're right. It's getting late anyways, Melon. Let's hit the hay. I could use some sleep. <sighs> Are you kidding me? This guy's already sound asleep. I barely walked upstairs. Ah, oh, he snores so loud. That's disgusting. I don't know if I'm going to be able to sleep now. Oh, it's a beautiful day. It's sunny out. Isn't it sunny? <laughs> See what I did there? Let me check, Melon. Ugh. I guess it's okay. It's not that nice. This is your favorite weather conditions, bro. It's literally pure sun outside. This does not look like pure sun, Melon. It's actually a thunderstorm. Bro, thunderstorms are my favorite. Then you can sit inside and it's all cozy. Oh, I love thunderstorms. Hey, Sonny, do you mind grabbing some crops for me? Uh, I just don't really want to get wet right now and I got some other chores to do. Yeah, Melon, that'd be nice of me, wouldn't it? But I'm not gonna do that for you. Make yourself useful and go collect the crops yourself you mangy scum ow chill fine i'll go grab the crops relax dude what is wrong with you what is getting in your head these days bro faster melon faster yo chill these crops aren't gonna harvest themselves ow what the heck Melon, what happened? I friggin' exploded. Why are there mines outside? What is going on? Bro, I'm not getting any more crops. Sounds like a skill issue. Oh. Dude, why are you being so mean? What the heck? If I was being so mean, I'd probably do something like this. What the heck? Why do you have TNT? Good luck, Melon. Ah. <sighs> Feels good. I slept so well last night. That was amazing. Good morning, Melon. Sunny, I had the best dream ever, bro. It was amazing. There was sunshine and flowers and everything was great. Do you want me to do anything for you today, huh? 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 What, Melon, are you okay? No, I'm just in a great mood and I want to give back to the community, aka you. So I will do anything you want me to do today, Sunny. This is just not normal behavior from you, Melon. I was gonna do some house chores and farm some crops. Do you want to help me collect the wheat? Yes, I would love to. Give me the wheat for Sonny. Anything for you. Sonny is my main man and he's pretty awesome. Guys, this is really weird. Melon's being way too nice today. I am so confused. Here's the wheat. Thank you, Melon. Here's seeds too. Oh, can you replant those? Oh, of course. Of course. Yes. Anything you want, Sonny. I've got to go feed the chickens and milk the cows, Melon. I'll be right back. No! Don't you dare! What's wrong? Are you okay? Sit back and relax and let me do it. I'm gonna go grip those udders. Uh, guys, something is really not right with Melon. He's not letting me do any of the chores, and he's acting way too nice. Anything else you want me to do, Sonny? All the cows have been milked, and every chore has been done. Is there anything you could possibly want me to do else? I'll do it for you. I'll do it. It's no problem. Melon, like, maybe just tell me how good of a friend I am, and how I'm the best brother ever, and I'm super awesome. Bro, you're the best brother ever, and you're my best friend. Guys, guys, this isn't normal. Melon's acting really weird. He's acting so strange today. Mmm. Milky is so good. Have you tried some of this milk, Sonny? Yeah, you can keep that milk to yourself. You stay away from me, Melon. No, take all this milk. What did you do? Ah! I gave you what you deserve because you've been such a bad friend. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Oh, I just barely made it out with my life. Where are you going, Melon? Yo! Chill! What the heck? Oh my god! Half a heart! Half a heart! Hey, Melon. What? I hope that knuckle sandwich tasted good. Bro, what is going on? I keep responding. This is so scary. I'm just gonna go in the closet and hope everything is okay. Yeah, you do that, Melon. Stay right there. I heard another TNT. What the heck is that? 
Close the doors! Oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm in lava! Sonny, you took it too far! Why did you blow up my house? First of all, that was our house. And second of all, it's not that big of a deal. Depending on your perspective, that might be an enhancement. What if you were from the nether? You might appreciate this. Bro, I'm gonna tell you right now, I do not appreciate this. Well, you might appreciate this. Just cool down and sleep it off. Bro, it's not even nighttime. It's okay, this is a special bed. You can take a nap anytime you want. Um, okay. What just happened? Where the heck am I? Dude, I don't even think this is the nether, and Sunny's not around anymore. Oh, I got to find a way off of this little dirt island. Please give me some of these blocks. Dude, all of them are just getting incinerated. Just give me one. Give me- This is hopeless. I can slowly get rid of them. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Uh, guys, something is not right with Melon. I'm gonna see how far I could push him. Let's really find out how nice he is. Hey, Melon, you're feeling pretty positive today, aren't you? Yes, I am. Well, I'm positively sure that there's no way you'll give me a stack of diamonds. Oh, I can do you better. I'll give you a stack of diamond blocks. What? Uh, okay. That's really generous. Um, can I have more diamonds? Uh, I'll give you something even better, Sonny. Here you go. Bro, you gave me netherite too? Melon, what's wrong with you? Would you like anything else, Sonny? I could give you more diamonds. Is that not enough? Here's more diamonds. Take them all, Sonny. Take all of them. I don't want the diamonds. I want the mail. I just heard a letter come in for me. Oh, don't worry. I'll get it. I'll get it for you. Uh, okay. Can I do anything for myself, Melon? No, I'll read this for you too. Dear Sonny, you are the most bravest, handsome, incredible person in all of my Minecraft. Can you please help us? We need your help more than anything right now, and we'll reward you with riches beyond your wildest dreams. That sounds awesome! How do I go help them? I need to save these people! I want the reward. I want the reward. Sonny, if you want the reward, you'll have to go here. Sleep in this luxurious bed, and you shall awaken in the greatest place known to man. This is so weird, but I'll go with it. Whoa, it's so beautiful here. And I've got to save these people. They've asked me to help them and help them I shall. Mostly because they have a really big reward and they're going to make me super, super rich. Why do I have an ender pearl? Yo, I can use this to escape. Okay, I've got one shot, one opportunity. Would you capture it or just let it slip? Yes, I made it off. Now, gotta figure out what this place is, and more importantly, how to get out of here! What is this place? I've gotta explore around and figure out to see if there's a way out of here. This biome is so weird. Wait, what? How did I get tools all of a sudden? What is going on? And I even have armor. Bro, what? Uh... I think I know why I have tools. There's a bunch of mobs. But how is all this happening? Oh, look, a skeleton horse. Hey, can I ride you? I can. This is awesome, bro. I got skeleton horses. Hey, chill, creeper. They killed my skeleton. Ow! These bushes hurt. Yo, this bunch of zombie pigmen. <laughs> Imagine if I hit one, that would suck. Wait, why are they mad at me? And what is that thing? Dude, what is going on? What the heck is that thing? I gotta get out of here. I've gotta get out of here. Bro, it's so creepy. It's so creepy. I think I lost that weird baby thing finally. Oh, piece it. What the heck is this? And there are more of those baby things, but they're grown up. Something tells me I have to do this if I want to get out of here. Please. Those things are so cursed. Okay, okay. Just gotta do a jump here. What's in that chest? Yo, a negatite sword? Bro, that thing looks crazy. I'm gonna do a little cheat here. Jump on the chest and stop. They're called tormentors. Dude, they're too coarse. They're too cursed. Maybe just die. Please die. I've gotta kill these tormentors, bro. It's the only way around. No, maybe I can jump on the side. No, please. Wait, what the heck just happened? I spawned back here like nothing happened in the first place. What is going on? I can do this. I can do this. I just got to go quick. I got to go real quick. Quick. Please, please don't let them hit me. No, no. Back where I started. Kill these stupid tormentors. They're so creepy. Okay, I'm a little closer. Maybe I can hit them better here. Yes, I can hit them. Yo, just two more left. Please, please die. 
I'm gonna get close up. <gasps> get me in there! Die! One more. Yes, it's over. No, I can finally escape. Jump here. Do next bit of parkour. It's almost over. I can feel it. Yo, get out of here, boy. Hey, get out of my way. A slime block jump. My worst enemy! No! No! Attempt number two! Yes, I've done it! Finish up this parkour. Here we go. You think a stupid spider is gonna stop me? A spider could never. Yo! Zytrite boots. What the heck is this? Let me get some of that. Yo, that's pretty good. It's almost as good as diamond armor. Get this spawner out of here, bro. Uh -oh. I've got, uh... I'm just gonna keep running. <laughs> I've got no pickaxe. No. Why? Get away! Get away! I gotta keep moving. I gotta keep moving. Or these tormentors will swarm me. Yo. There's so many. There's so many. Ah, and there's a ghast. Dude, dude, I'm blind. I can't see. Stay away. There's a Zytrate pickaxe on the floor. Yes, I need this to get rid of these stupid spawners. Please, please. Now, I need to clear out these tormented. Oh, there's so many. There's so many. Get rid of them all. Oh, no, I might die. I might die. Oh, ah, one heart. One heart. Are you kidding me? Please. Please. I think I got all the spawners. I don't think there's any left. Oh, wait, there's one more. Final spawner. Yes. I've destroyed them all. Now I just gotta get rid of this guy right here. Please leave. Please leave. Ah, oh, freedom at last. What the heck is that? Why are there three hero brines looking at me? In order to pass, you must defeat three of my clones. Okay, that's all it needs. I'll defeat them. Let me at them! What you gonna do, hero brine? What you gonna do? Oh, they actually hit hard. They hit hard. Please, stay away. You're supposed to die. You're supposed to die. Oh, can't hit me now. Not so big now, Mr. Hero Brine. Destroy you. Yes! I defeated your clones. Now what? If I jump in this hole right here, I'll have a chance of surviving. Chance is better than anything to get out of here alive. Please put me in! Hey, this doesn't even look so bad, uh, Sunny. Yes, Melon. I got a new job working for Hero Brian. He pays pretty good. Uh, what are you doing? I get paid in armor, weapons, and tormentors! Yo! Not anything but those. They're so creepy! Ah! Ah! That's it, Sunny. And you know what's more powerful? Giants! Yo, Chip! Sonny, get back here. I need to slay you. I'm the final boss? I think so. Oh, no. Get here! I didn't want to do this to you, Melon. Actually, I really, really did. Aw, oh, looks like you're gonna kill me. Ow! Looks like you're getting close. Yo, I'll finish you off, Sonny. Good night, Melon. Ow! What was that? Goodbye, Melon. <laughs> <laughs> I've been wandering this world for so long. I entered this winter wonderland. I hope I'm getting close. Yo, I am. This must be the city. Quandale Winterton. Oh, <laughs> I get it because it's snowy and it's winter, but it's still Quandale. What's that? You need me to save this village? Well, what's the password to this chest if I'm supposed to get this armor? Oh, one, two, three. Sounds easy enough. One, two, three, open. Yo, God armor. What the heck? 1,024 armor, knockback, resistance, and armor toughness. Bro, what is this bow? The god bow. Oh my gosh. Somebody pinch me. I must be dreaming. The god pickaxe. The god sword. The god axe. This is way too powerful. I'm not sure I'm worthy. Quandale Winterton, thank you. Now I put it on, and I'm the strongest player in all of Minecraft. Oh, I feel good. So what? Now I just go and save this city? Oh, that sounds easy. I got this. Yo, they even got speedboats ready. Let's go into town and save these people. Where are the monsters? Let me at them. Let me at them. I don't see any monsters. I thought I was supposed to save this place. Hello? Where is everybody? Ah, there is a wither. Where did he come from? Where did he come from? Shoot him. Shoot him. Wait, why isn't this working? What do I need? God arrows or something? Whatever. I'll go in with the axe. Yo! I can one-shot these guys. Oh, I'll save this village in no time. Oh, you're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. Ugh. 
I'm so powerful. This is amazing. I can't wait to tell Melon all about this. Yo, that was easy. When you got muscles like me and a brain this big, defeating the enemy is not a problem. I guess I just gotta go tell Quandale that the city is saved. And I've got these nether stars to prove it. Quandale, I did it, dude. The city is saved. All of the town folk can come out of hiding now. I even have the proof. Now, where's that reward I was promised? I want to be the richest, most wealthy, most powerful player in all of Minecraft. Wait, Quandale, another luxury bed? Melon already gave me one of these. Uh, I was lied to. Wait a second. Maybe this will take me somewhere better. Ah. <sighs> Wait, what the heck? Why am I back in bed? Stay away from me! Stay away from me! Don't open the closet. I don't want to talk to you. Melon, why are you being so weird, bro? You were so nice to me earlier. Can I have some diamonds? Can you do my chores? Please! Stay away! Wait, Melon, what's wrong? What did I do? What's going on? Go away. Go away. I'm not talking to you anymore. I'm moving away. I'm switching worlds. I'm gonna go live, I don't know, in the end or the nether or the far lands. Any- Just stay away from me! Melon, use your words! I I don't understand. All I did was wake up this morning. I had the coolest dream ever. I was a hero. I saved this city. You gave me diamonds and netherite. I was absolutely goaded. I had the worst dream ever. You killed me, harassed me, destroyed me, humiliated me over and over again. That does sound like a nightmare. I'm sorry, Melon, but that wasn't me, bro. You can't blame me for your own subconscious. I'm out of here, Sonny. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Guys, please click the like and subscribe button right now. If we don't get at least 1,000 new subscribers on this video, I don't think Melon's gonna film with me again. Today in Minecraft, I have a special canvas and anything I draw comes to life. Whoa, this melon house is insane. There's no way you built this. Well, I wouldn't say I built it, but yeah, look, I even drew a subscribe button next to it. Please press it right now to help us reach 500,000 subscribers. Yo, Sonny, I challenge you to a race. You're gonna get destroyed. That's what you think, bro. I'll meet you on the tracks. I just gotta finish up my vehicle, okay? It's kind of missing tires. All right, bro. 10 emeralds are on the line. Just remember. Guys, Melon thinks he's gonna smoke me in this race, but he's got no clue. I just got a brand new iron tier engine. It just came in and it gives me super speed. Now, all I gotta do is modify my vehicle a little bit by installing the engine and adding the wheels yes she's so pretty and i pick it up and i go to the racetrack melon you're going down ride your quad why are you holding it because i'm strong bro i got these muscles on me okay so where's the starting point here it's all the way back here i don't know why you ran over there all right sonny in three two one let's go oh my gosh she's so fast melon slow down. See you, nerd! I'm way quicker than you! What the heck? What the heck? I'm zooming! I'm absolutely zooming! Yes, let's go! Let's go! I win! Sonny, you're destroying me! What the heck? Why are you so fast? I'm the goat! I'm actually the goat at driving! Guys, I don't understand how Sonny's so quick! I'm gonna lose! Oh, wait, what's this billboard? What does this say? Billy Buttfart Art Gallery Royal Palace. Hey, Mel, and did you already give up? Yes, Sonny. I don't know how your four wheeler is so much quicker than mine. See you, nerd. Let's go. <laughs> I knew that engine upgrade was worth it. Whatever, bro. You might have won this, but I don't even really care. I want to know what's up with this art gallery. It looks so beautiful. I wish I could draw like that. Yo, Sonny. Sonny. Yeah, what's up, Melon? Do you want to head to this art gallery with me? It's going to be so awesome. Bro, that sounds pretty boring, but fine. Let's Let's go. Let's do this thing. Sonny, we've made it to the art gallery. This place is beautiful. I guess it actually looks kind of cool. Whoa, this place is awesome. Hey, Melon, can I get those emeralds from that race so I can purchase some artwork? Fine, bro. A deal's a deal. Here's 10 emeralds. Yeah, cough them up. Yo, I'm gonna go buy the finest piece of art in this entire exhibit. 
it. Yeah. This artwork is glorious. Check this out, Sonny. Yes, with these emeralds, I'll purchase the finest art. Look at this, Sonny. It's beautiful. The way his eyes look at the world. They're so blue and deep and depthful and I don't know what other- No, shut up! I don't know what you're saying! Whoa, the giant donut. It's perfect. Yo, Melon, I'm gonna buy this for you. <laughs> it's literally a self-portrait. Dude, this is not a self-portrait. You know what? You keep this. Bro, when someone buys you a gift, you've got to show it respect. It's yours. <sighs> Fine, I'll keep it. But Sonny, I'm feeling inspired. This place is so beautiful. I want to become an artist myself. Quandale. Quandale! Uh, guys? <laughs> I think Melon's losing his mind. The art has gone to his head. Guys, I may not have any talent. I may not be able to draw. I may not be able to paint. But Quandale surely has some tools that'll make me be able to draw the most beautiful, spectacular artworks. Quandale, I made it. Do you have the stuff? You just made me come back from my vacation so I could sell you stupid art supplies. You could have just said no, Quandale. Say no to my... I would never. It's in the crate. Give me the emeralds and you can take it all. Um, Quandale, I don't have any emeralds, but I do have this painting of a poop. Melon, where did you get this? This is the poop by the famous Sir Dijon Benin. It really represents the struggle of everyday people. Oh, I bet I can get at least 10 million diamonds at the next auction for this beauty. Wait, what? Quandale, that was worth 10 million emerald blocks. No! Oh, well, at least I've got some awesome art supplies in easy some canvases, and a beautiful palette. Kind of weird, this palette has some sort of glow to it. Hmm, but it should still do its job. Guys, for my first painting, I'm gonna draw a beautiful piece of nature. I need to find a beautiful landscape. Oh yes, this tree right here will do the trick. And here we go. And begin painting the tree. Gonna need to have this gray, gray tone to the wood. Oh yeah, absolutely gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Some nice dark acacia leaves absolutely perfect signed by the melon wait a second this tree just appeared out of nowhere the canvas anything I draw comes to life hold on a second does that mean if I draw <laughs> <laughs> diamonds. Oh, the diamonds. Yes, yes. And then times 64. No way. No way. I got a whole stack of diamonds. This is awesome. Hold on a second. The true power that this canvas gives me is the ability to prank Sonny! <laughs> and I know just the thing to do. Oh, my statue, it's almost complete. All I've got to do is add my beautiful face. Oh, this is going to be awesome. <laughs> I can't wait for Melon to get back and see my artwork. What the heck is Sonny doing? He's building a giant statue of himself. That's it. I know just what to do. Let me just set up the canvas right here. And let's just draw Sonny's statue. Don't worry, I'm just being a nice guy. I'm helping Sonny complete his statue. Then I put my really awesome sunglasses on. Yep, guys, just helping him finish his statue. <laughs> With the melon head on it! Oh, yes. This is gonna be beautiful. Oh, he's gonna love it. Oh my god. <laughs> he's gonna be so mad. That looks perfect. Look at him building. Now all I've got to do is sign. And... Sign. What the heck just happened? My face. What happened to my beautiful face? Guys, quickly. I got to get rid of the evidence. Yo, Sonny, bro. Nice statue. It looks beautiful. Especially the head. Melon, what did you do? I didn't do anything, bro. I don't know why you built a statue of me. It's very nice. Bro, what did you do? How? How did you... Put a watermelon head on that! Dude, I didn't do anything! How in the heck could I build a watermelon head that quickly? I don't know, but you're clearly up to something. Dude, I don't know why you built a head of me to begin with. I think you're just going crazy. Shush, bro! You're clearly just jealous because you lost the race against me. Yeah, that's why you had to go do this. Oh, you think I'm jealous? All right, 
I demand a rematch, Sonny. Yeah, right. As if you could beat me the second time around. I accept. It's over for you, Sonny. Just wait till I get my four-wheeler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll see you at the track. Time to grab my speed mobile. This thing goes quick. And now I'm ready to race. Guys, quickly before the race starts, I need to get my four-wheeler into the garage to make some upgrades. <laughs> I don't think Sonny's here right now. Time to put it on the stand. All right, right, let me inspect this and see what I'm working with. A wood tier engine? This is trash! I need to take this out and make myself an upgrade. Okay, so we just do a little bit of drawing and it looks kind of something like this, I guess. A little bit of that, the top of the engine. Then I want it to be diamond tier. <laughs> so the lining of it will be made out of diamonds. Oh, yes. That's perfect. Oh, my engine is gonna be so powerful. And it's got the little thing back here. A little shkadumpa dump. I don't really know what this is. And boom. My diamond engine has been created. All I've gotta do is sign. Bye, Melon. Yo, it's actually here. Yes, it's beautiful. And now, bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> I have a diamond engine. Uh, just gotta get rid of this evidence. And it was like I was never here. Yo! What's up, Sonny? You ready to do this thing? Yeah, bro! It's about time! Three, two, one! I'm zooming! I'm zooming! Let's go! Wait, how are you so fast? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna win! Yes! I told you you stood no chance! Get back here, Melon, you absolute cheat! I saw you cheat! I saw you! You took a shortcut like this! No, I didn't, Sonny! I won! Fair and square! And hold on, let me just slap you real quick! Let me just slap you! No! <laughs> You're trash! My four-wheeler! It's shredded! This is all I have left! <laughs> Oh, that's why you lost. You don't have a diamond engine. <laughs> You're so silly. Why would you only have an iron one? Wait, you have a diamond engine? How is that even possible? Because I'm rich, Sonny. I'm rich. Wait a second, dude. How did you afford those diamonds? Uh, none of your business. Oh, you think you're so cool because you've got diamonds and that fancy engine. Oh, yeah? Well, wait till you see till I steal it. Where's that ATV? Get over here. Oh, no. Don't steal my ATV. Then I just bring it to my workshop and I just gotta pick it up, put it down, and rob it. Give me that engine. Yes, I'll take your tires, too. Oh, no, guys. Whatever will I do? Guess I'll just draw another four-wheeler. Take that, Melon! I stole your diamond engine! Oh no, Sonny, whatever will I do? And it's gonna boop, 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 bop. Give me a new diamond engine! Wait, what the heck? How did that actually work? And now I have a diamond engine, and I'm chilling. You've been actually drawing things into existence this whole time? How did you even get that canvas? Quandale gave it to me, bro. That poop drawing that you said was really ugly and you mocked me with? Well, guess what? Apparently, it was worth 10 million emerald blocks. You've got to be kidding. Why? Anyways, guys, Sonny's being a baby. I'm going to draw the most awesome, biggest pyramid of all time. Yes, gigantic pyramid. It's so gorgeous. And then I wonder what happens if I put times 1,000. Yeah, that's a lot of zeros. That is a lot of zeros. What happens if I make a pyramid this big? Signed by... Hi, Melon. Wait, what's happening? Why is the world shaking? Sonny! Sonny! I think I messed up big time! Melon, what have you done? Why is it an earthquake? Sonny, where the heck are we? I have no idea. Melon, what did you do? No! Well, Sonny, I'm right back here, so I guess death is not an escape. Aw, oh, man, I'm stuck with you. But I have an idea on how to progress through this place, Sonny. Honey, with the power of the painting. You really think that's a good idea? We got trapped here because of what you drew last time. I know, but it's because I put times like one million billion. I'm not going to do that again. All I'm going to do is draw a line. Okay. Oh, I get it. Like a little bridge out of here. Yeah, so I'm drawing the line and I'll draw our 
two little platforms. Uh, Melon, before you sign that drawing, I've got another idea. I was building that statue of myself and I have a lot of extra blocks. So maybe I could just build us a bridge out of- Dang it, I can't build here! Yep, Sonny, that's the way she goes sometimes. Anyways, I've got the painting completed. Yeah! Did it work, Sonny? Did it? It worked! Nice job! Now we can get to the next area, which is just a giant dead end, bro! I think I have to do the same thing again. All right, draw us another bridge. It's the only way. Okay, okay. Okay, we got our two little platforms and a red bridge in between. And sign. What? No! Melon, I think the gap is too wide. A bridge isn't gonna work here. Okay, hold on. I've got another idea. Maybe if I draw... Hold on. This might be genius. Wait a second. Are you thinking about making us elytras? That'd be really smart with fireworks. We could just fly over. No, Sonny. I'm thinking of a giant trampoline. Yeah! That's actually so smart. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm gonna bounce so high. And sign. Trampoline. Pauline by Big Man Melon. Sonny, did it work? There's only one way to find out! Yo, yo, yo! It worked! Make it, make it! Ah! Please, please! Uh, Melon, I think you're gonna need to come give me a double bounce. I got you, Sonny. Kala Bunga! Woo! Come on! Whoa! It actually worked! Yo! That was awesome! Sick jumps, bro. Uh, but Melon, you left the canvas. Uh... One minute later. And I got it. Nice. Now, what the heck is this room? There's a pressure plate. Let me step on it. Whoa, it opens the door. It doesn't open the door. Wait, Sonny, again. Me genius. Me think idea. Me think me draw block a sand above this and then it'll- Shush, bro! You're talking so annoyingly. Just draw some obsidian to hold the door back. Okay, okay. Sand will get crushed, bro. Just put some obsidian and everything will be fine. That's actually really smart, Sonny. Okay, so I draw the door. The door is a yellow line on the bottom, a purple line in the middle, and orange on top. Yes, yes. Purple line in the middle, orange on top. Oh, melon. And then obsidian block blocking the door. Yes. Perfect. Now I'll open it and sign that. And I call this one blocking door. Boom. Did it work? Yo, it actually worked. Let's go. Oh, Johnny, is this another? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I almost forgot the painting again. You have one job, Melon. Well, two jobs because I also have to paint. Yeah, you actually have all of the jobs. I have nothing. I'm unemployed. Ah, uh, feels good. Can you draw us a little hand cranker so we can twist this? Maybe a valve. Yeah, I got you, Sonny, but I got some bad news. I only have three canvases left. I hope it's enough. It better be, or we're gonna be trapped forever. We need to make ourselves a valve. Valve will do. So gray valve, like this, and then I think it's got a little red there, too, and it's perfect. Valve by Big Man Melon. Yo, it worked! White valve handle. Check it out, Sonny. Whoa! Do it again! Uh, Sonny, I gotta go back and grab the painting. I almost forgot it again. <laughs> yeah, bro, you keep leaving it. And then, crank it twice. Bro, that was insane! That whole room switched on an axis. That is crazy. Now, where are we? Let's go down the staircase and find the exit. Police! Bro, hopefully this is the exit! That's a lot of zombies. That is a lot of zombies, Sonny. I don't think we could fight these all off, bro. Can you draw some iron golems or something? Oh, that's so smart, Sonny. Okay, okay. I'll draw iron golem. They got some long arms. Would you guys shut up? You're so loud. Your breathing is disgusting. Your breath stinks. Uh, yeah. Hold on a second, Sonny. And good luck down there. Ah, what the heck? <laughs> Please. Don't worry, Sonny. I'm almost done the drawing. I can save you. No, Melon, Melon. It's gonna be too late for me. Wait, I can save myself. I could save my... I'm dead. Don't worry. The iron golems have been drawn. Times ten. Sign those golems. Spot them in. Whoa, it's actually working. Whoa. They're wrecking the zombies. They didn't even stand a chance. <sighs> 
Mallet, I'm back! What happened? You made it just in time, Sonny. The Iron Golems wrecked the zombies. Ow! I'm so happy for the Iron Golems. Imagine if you didn't push me down into the pit of death beforehand. Dude, I thought maybe I could draw the Iron Golems in time to save you. What is this room? I don't know, but it better be the last room, Sonny. We only have one more painting left. Melon, if you run out of canvases before we escape, we're gonna be done for! We gotta think carefully about what we need here. Let's see. Uh, we could probably go for a bucket of water, or a waterfall, or an elytra with fireworks! That would've been pretty good for everything! I think you're right, Sonny. We need some water on this lava. Oh, guys. Look what I have to work with here. So here's the lava, right? There's the lava all around here. And then we've got the agua pouring down onto the lava. Whoa, that looks pretty neat. And then this will create cobble stone egg. Whoa, you're doing water on both sides? That's intuitive. And then it's perfect. This will create a path so then we can get to the other side. I call this cobble and sign. And that was our last painting, so I hope this worked. Oh, it's working! Yes! Whoa! It actually worked! Dude, Sonny, come take a look! Whoa! Now all we have to do is get to the water! Ow! 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 You almost made it, Sonny. <laughs> and I'm gonna take my canvas now and properly make the jump! Ow! Ow! Woo. Okay, I can do this. Yes. Nothing like a good hot tub to cook yourself into the next area. Oh, this better be the final area, Sonny, because I'm out of paintings. Uh, what is this? Greetings, Greetings. I, I am, am the wise, wise fish. fish. Do you know why you are here? Uh, no. And what the heck is a wise fish? Melon, show some respect. Can't you tell we're amongst a god? Dude, it's just a fish, bro. I eat fish all the time. Bro, everybody knows about the wise fish. It's common knowledge. Okay, okay, okay. I bow down to you, wise fish. Yes, Mr. Wise Fish, we bow down to your almighty power and we kiss your feet. You are here because of your ignorance. You have been using the sacred palette for your own pleasure. Uh, I didn't know this palette was sacred. You think this is funny, you stinky melon-headed idiot? I'm sorry, I didn't know. I actually didn't know. Melon, you must kiss his feet. I'm not kissing his feet, son. He doesn't even have feet. Relax, he's a fish. Just make the kiss sound. The power that the pallet holds isn't meant to be wielded by a mere mortal. But it's so cool. I will give you one last chance. Throw all of it in the lava before you, and I will return you to your realm. If you don't, I promise you, you will feel my wrath. Okay, okay, okay. Just let me think about it. Melon, there's no time to think about it. Just throw the canvas in the lava and be done with it. And that pallet, too. Maybe, Sonny, I could draw him dying from the canvas. And the wise fish is dead. Almighty wise fish, I'm sorry. Uh, you heard nothing. Uh, Melon will sacrifice the items. Ah! No! You've made a very wise choice there, young one. Now be gone. What's happening? Well, Sonny, I lost the pallet. Well, I at least still have your diamond engine. Good for you. We don't have any four-wheelers. We don't have a house. We're broke, but we do have this statue. And a huge pyramid. Although, isn't that where the wise fish lives? Maybe we should stay away from that place. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Guys, quickly, press the like and subscribe button to help us rebuild our home. Today in Minecraft, we got kidnapped by Dr. Longbottoms and placed inside of a zoo. Ah, I can't take it in here anymore. Sonny, we gotta get out of here. Quickly, goats, like the video right now to open up this gate. In three, two, one. Yes, finally we can escape. Melon, how do you always get us in these types of situations? We're lost, confused, we don't know where we are. We're just in this itchy jungle, bro. There's bugs crawling all over us. Me? This was you, bro. You had the map, and you lost it about two miles back. Bro, it wasn't my fault. You punched me into the water, and then the map got all soggy and crumply, and it disintegrated. So really, it's your fault. Dude, just... Follow me, I'll lead us back to safety. Do you even know where you're going, Melon? Uh, yeah, I do. 
All right. Dang it, Melon, you're lost again. Follow me. I'll get us out of this jungle. All right, Sonny. Over here, maybe? Somewhere over here? Ah! Melon? Melon? Yeah, what? Where are we? Dude, how does this always happen? One moment we're in a jungle, and the next we're down here in Dr. Longbottoms' lair? Dr. Longbottoms, what are you up to? Why did you trap us? Ah, yes. You two have finally fallen for my trap. Oh, this is going to be so fun. You two will make a great addition to my collection. Oh, Melon, <laughs> this isn't good. What does he mean, his collection? Yeah, what do you mean, your collection? Let's see here. I just have to start the doohickey and you two will be ready for exhibition. What? What does that mean? Uh, Mella, I'm starting to feel a bit sleepy. <sighs> Wait, what? I'm surrounded by bears. What is going on? Wait, wait a second. Why do I have two rows of hearts? Wait, I'm a bear. Dr. Longbottoms. He transformed me into a giant brown grizzly. And I've got strength 10. I actually think this is cool. I'm so powerful. Melon, where are you? Are you one of these bears? Hello? Dude, I'm a badger. What the heck? That's like the lamest animal ever. Wait, where are you? I want to see this. Bro, I'm a badger. What does a badger even do, bro? I'm completely... Wait a second. Yo, I can break blocks so easily. Where are you, Sonny? Let me help you out. I'm up here. I'm the brown bear jumping. Please, let me out here. I can't fit. I'm too big. Big. Can you break these blocks? Yeah, I got you. There you go, Sonny. I need more space, dude. I'm not that skinny. Okay. There you go. Oh, Melon, please. Ow, you, you gotta move. You're too big. Don't make me hit you. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mr. Bear. Look, I'll let you out. There we go. I'm still too thick. Oh, I made it. There we go. Sonny, I don't want to be a badger. We've got to figure out a way to get back to normal. You're right. But Melon, we've got to be careful. I can already tell that Dr. Longbottoms has secret agents located all around the zoo. We got to make sure we avoid the guards. Uh, Sonny? Here. Uh, run! I'm right behind you, Melon. I mean, Badger. I mean, what do I even call you now? You can call me a Melon Badger. Yo, yo. Okay, we gotta... We gotta find a safe place to talk about a plan. You're right, you're right. Over here looks good with the villager merchant. Yeah, very inconspicuous. He's just visiting the petting zoo right now. Okay, Melon Badger, what's the plan? Okay, Sonny, do you see that laser fence over there? Whoa, that's pretty cool over there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, it's armed with a ton of guards, and they even have a skeleton in the shed. No way. Sonny, I'm gonna go in the shed, dig a tunnel, and disable those lasers so we can both escape. Okay, Melon Badger, that's perfect. I'll distract a guard. You go disable those lasers so we can get out of here. All right, all right. I'm going. I'm going. Distract that guard. Oh, hey, look at me. I'm a big old bear. I got out of my exhibit. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? That's it. Die. Wait, Melon, he's actually sound asleep. Oh, wait. That, that makes this easy. <laughs> now time to go in here and dig it all out. Yes. Yo. I found a secret tunnel. Melon, are you in the control room yet? I think one of these guards is getting suspicious of me. Bruh, I'm nervous. Hurry up. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Wait, this is the control room. Right here. Yes, I made it in. I made it inside. I think if I press this lever, it'll disable the lasers. Huh. Yo, it worked, Melon. I can walk straight past this security now. Hey, hey, what up, Badger? Hey, what's up, Sonny? Let me just come out here now. And now we can make the escape. Uh, what the heck was that? What did we just hear? Bro, what's going on? Yo, there's an explosion. Wait, this makes it so much better for us. This is our chance. We can use this to escape. Wait, Badger Melon, don't leave me behind. No zoo buddies left behind, please. Oh, oh, yeah, I got you, I got you. Hold on. Can you move that door? There you go. Thank you. Whoa! Ow, you pushed me in lava! Ow! Ow! I'm gonna die now. Here, maybe the salmon can fix it. Oh, oh, I just survived. 
One heart. Dude, that was close. We've got to get out of this zoo, both of us. Yeah, Sonny, let me go first. You're too big. You're going to end up pushing me in the lava again. Yeah, you sure? I'm right behind you. Yo, chill. Chill. Come here, little badger, badger, badger. Ow, ow, ow. I'm too thick. I'm even putting myself in the flames. Relax, Sonny, relax. We got to get into the sewer system. Oh, you're right. Every good escape starts in a volcanic layer and goes into a sewer. How could I forget? Follow me! Whoa. Sonny, this leads straight out of the city. Let's go! Dude, we've gotta be getting close to the sewer exit. I could taste the fresh air. Uh, it just smells like a whole lot of poop right now to me, Sonny. Oh, sorry. I can taste the feces. Mm-mm-mm. Delicious. You are disgusting, Sonny. I think we finally found it, Melon. This has gotta be the way out. Come on. Yo, move your big bumpa trumpa out of my way. You're so fat. Dude, it's just a nice bottom. Enjoy my cheeks. Oh, I made it out. Quandale Dingleberry, what are you doing here? Thank you, Quandale. Uh, Quandale, do you have a cure for this? I want to be back to my normal self. But you know where to find it? Melon, we've got to break into Dr. Longbottom's house. It's the only way. Hey, what's in this security chest, Quandale? Wait, what? Inside of this chest, there's potions that let us transform into sharks? Hold on, Melon. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? Boom! Get out of here! Whoa, you're crazy strong, Sonny. Yeah, bruh. I've been working out. Yo, Sonny! Okay, okay. I'll get serious here. Quandale, what's the password to the chest? Are you kidding me? It's just one, two, three. Four. Yo, let's go. Wait, what's in here? Sharkify, a netherite pick, and de sharkify. Whoa. Wait. We're gonna have to become sharks and then become normal afterwards. Sonny, come with me. Wow, Melon, you're so intelligent. What a big leap. That was crazy. It's almost like Quandale told us that. Nope, I figured it out myself. Let's become sharks! Whoa! Melon, it worked! Quick, get in the water! Yo, let's go. We must swim to Dr. Longbottoms' house and then steal the antidote. We've just gotta get out to the open ocean now. Let's Let's go. Yo, what has Dr. Longbottoms done to the land? It looks like he's terraformed this place to make it have maximum security. Yo, Sonny, this is where we need to de-sharkify. Come close, come close. I'm right here. Let's go. And boom! It worked, Melon! I'm back to being a brown bear! And I'm back to being a badger, but now I've got to... Ow! 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 Run, dude! I told you terraformed this and added security systems. Sonny, there's only one way around this. And that's through. Uh, Melon, it's all sand. You can't dig through it. You want to bet? Watch me! Melon, I have a better idea. You could give me the netherite pickaxe and I can help you destroy all the turrets. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty good idea. Here you go. Yes. Yes. Ow! 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 Nice one, Melon. How do you enjoy the taste of sand on your head? Oh, closer. Closer. No, I'm scared. Ow! 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 Melon, it hurts. It hurts. All right, all right, Sonny. Just come with me. We're gonna tunnel under there. Melon, bro. This tunnel is taking too long. I've got a better idea. Let's just charge through. What's the worst that can happen? Uh, we die a horrible death. But Sonny, a wise man once said, the only way through is through. Let's go! Wow, that sounds really intellectual. Well, that's smart. I was thinking the saying here would be nothing ventured, nothing gained. Ah! Ah! Ow! I exploded! I exploded! I'm getting obliterated! Nothing was gained, but we definitely adventured. Okay, Melon, I'm sorry that was a terrible idea. Yes, I think what he meant when the only way through is through is like through an underground tunnel. <laughs> Let's do it! I'm here to help! No, you really can't do much here, Sonny. You're, you're too big. Sonny, I think we've gone far enough. Look how long I drilled. My hands are killing me. Or my paws are killing me. But you're amazing. Look at the work you did. We might actually be able to get past Dr. Longbottom's security. Yeah, bro. Let me just check to see if this is far enough, okay, Sonny? I'll come back down to get you after. All right, I'll wait here because I'm too dang thick to fit. How's the view up there, partner? Sonny, this is perfect. This is perfect. We've made it up his hill. 
I believe. Yes, we're right behind his house. Okay, Sonny, I need you to come up. Yeah, I'd love to, but I have no way up, bruh. Wait, here's some blocks, bro. Take this and build up. Oh, thank you, Melon. This should work just fine. If I could grab them, I'm just too hefty. Okay, now I gotta build really carefully. Make sure I have enough space on all sides so I don't slip and fall. This is gonna take a while. You got any other blocks, not just sand? Uh, there you go. Yes, water. That was awesome. I'm doing it, Melon. I'm like a badger now. I believe in you, Sonny. Clear the path for me, little one. Uh, yes, I shall. And then build up again. Hold on, let me get rid of these blocks for you. There you go. Teamwork making the dream work. High five! Oh. Ow! Sorry, I got excited. Okay, this should be big enough. Yes, I'm through. Oh, wait, I gotta remove this little sand block. We did it, Melon. We actually did it. He made it to the top, Sonny. No more security systems. Now we just grab... Uh, what is going on? Why are there zombies? Why are there zombies? Don't worry. I'll handle this. I am a bear. Die. Die. Wait, there's spawners. I'll destroy the monsters. You get the spawners. I got you. I got you. Get these spawners out of here. Melon, where are you? There's a spawner right here. You've got to just... Oh, you're right there. <laughs> you're so tiny. I think I was sitting on you. Bro. Bro. Sonny. This isn't good. This isn't good. I'll handle it. I'll handle it, Melon. Get the spawners. Get the spawners. Okay. I'm going for this one. Got it. Got it. Run. There's too many husks. I need to eat my salmons. So many. Why does this boar want to eat me? Sonny, kill this boar. It's quick. Where are you? Sonny, kill the boar, please. It's after me now. What the heck? Die. I got him. He never stood a chance. It's good to be a big, burly, strong bear, you know? I could devour these guys in one hit. Oh, no. They've almost devoured me. Sonny, you've got to eliminate them. I'm trying my best. How many spawners are out there? I think I got rid of them all. There's just the zombies left. Melon. Move, bro. I'll finish the husks. Get out of here. All right, Sonny. I'm going to chill on some haystacks. You got this. I believe. I believe you can do it. This is perfect. We should have done this from the beginning. You're keeping them distracted. And then I can pick them off one. Oh, no. They see me. Yeah, really one by one. It's okay. I got this. There's only a handful left. Couple more hits. Die. Die. Uh, can you kill this last guy? Oh, yeah. I, I got you, bro. One and... There we go. Now, Sonny, it's time to infiltrate Dr. Longbottom's headquarters. Let's do this. Hey, hey Melon, I'm still kind of thick. Uh, I need help. Uh, yeah, you're gonna have to figure that out on your own because I found a little badger entrance to go into his base. This fool left a one block opening. Yo, there's all sorts of chests. Yo, there's tons of TNT. Tell me what else you find. Hopefully you can get your hands on the antidote. I don't want to be a bear anymore. I'm too thick. Yo, Dr. Longbottoms isn't here. He must have abandoned this place to run the zoo. You're right. And he thinks we're still in our little exhibits being good animals. Nice try, Dr. Longbottoms. Soon we'll get our revenge. This better have the antidote. Yo, it does. Let's go. Nice one, Melon. Quickly grab it and let's get out of here before Dr. Longbottoms returns. Sonny, there's something we've got to do. Yeah. Yeah, what's that? We've got to get rid of this place. It's disgusting. Dr. Longbottoms can't run these sick experiments anymore. You're right, dude. You know that TNT you found earlier? Start placing it inside of his house. <laughs> I already have, Sonny. And I'm gonna grab this redstone torch. Here we are. Bada bing. Bada boom. Sonny, this is gonna make a massive explosion. So we gotta be ready to run. First, let's use that antidote. I don't wanna get stuck on anything because I'm too fat. Yeah, you're right. Let's go! It's working! Yes! <gasps> oh, we're back to normal. This feels so good. This feels awesome! Now, Sonny, we got to get out of here. Light it up. No more experiments for Dr. Longbottoms. Let's dip! Revenge! Don't go in this minefield, Melon! Ow! Yo, 
Look at the aftermath. We did it. His base is completely gone. High five. But you know what's not completely gone? That like and subscribe button. Press on them quick. Oh yeah, this is another hide and seek movie. So stick around until the end to see some top secret moments. This is Minecraft hide and seek, but we're at the zoo. We have so many custom realistic animal mobs. It's so goaded. Hey, Melon, look at me. I'm a goat now. And if you want to be the goat, smash that subscribe button. Or else. Or else what, Melon? You don't want to know. Yo, Melon, we're here in the Madagascar Zoo, bruh. I'm ready to out hide and seek you. Yo, chill, Sonny, chill. Stop hitting me. I don't have any chill, bro. I'm gonna bust that melon top. Actually, wait. I'm out of here, bro. I'm hiding first. Good luck, Sonny. You got two minutes. Two minutes is all I need. Okay, guys. Look at this place. It's crazy. Yo, there's a beaver on the loose. Wait, no. This is a mongoose. There's literally a mongoose in this zoo? Yo, snakes, beware. You're gonna get caught slipping and eating up. Yo, iguanas? This place is epic. I love it. It's just like a real zoo where certain animals are allowed to get out of their cages and roam free. And then other... Wait, uh... This one is not a normal zoo animal that gets let loose. This is like that friendly seal. He looks kind of like a dog. I want to pet him like Doge. Hey, buddy, how are you doing? Actually, this is goaded. Melon's gonna think this is me because we've got the morph mod. Check this out. Big man, Sunny. I'm gonna morph into the seal. Yo, I could just chill anywhere on the map now. I'm with my bro. Check this homie out. Okay, now I don't actually want to be a seal, so let me just demorph really quick and find a better hiding spot because I want to check out more of this zoo. We've got giraffes over here. Why are they with the elephants? And why are they all stuck in this trench? What the heck? Be free. Get up here, homies. I'm giving them a way up. Maybe they prefer it down there. I don't know. Oh, wait. They're coming up. Let's go. What else is in this zoo? Let me check this cage right here. Uh, Maybe this is where all of these mongooses were supposed to be. Yo, guys, there's lions. Bruh. I think I'm going to morph into a lion and hide back here. These are one of my favorite animals because they got that yellow fur and Sonny's kind of like a lion. I just wish there was goats in here to be honest. Maybe I can add some. Yo. <laughs> oh my gosh. Forget being a lion. I'm gonna get goaded. Where else should these goats be? Wait a second. I'm gonna put them with the brown bears. Is this okay? Yes, the bears are friendly. What about the tigers? Are the tigers friendly? Hey, the goat's fine. All the animals are so friendly. This is awesome. Awesome. I just got to put a couple of goats in these exhibits to mess with Melon. And then some up here. Yo, I'm going to put some goats right when he comes out from seeking. It's going to distract him so much. Yes, he won't know what to do with himself. There's so many goats. Sonny, you got 30 seconds left, dude. Yo, chill, chill, chill. 30 seconds. That's plenty, bro. I'll be good. I'll be good. I've just got to pick my morph. I'm goaded. Let's do this. So guys, I'm the only goat that's chilling with the elephants, okay? I'm literally the elephant in the room. But it's fine. He won't see me as long as they swarm me. They're literally encircling me with their big elephant tusks. This is epic. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. Okay, Sonny, it's been a long time. But now I'm gonna take this netherite sword and I'm gonna shake. Wait, what the heck is this? Is this a normal goat? Yo, Melon, chill, bro. You don't have to stab me or any goats or any animals with that sword. Well, I just killed a goat. <laughs> Bro, I don't remember there being this many goats out here. What the heck, Sonny? Why would you stab a goat, bro? We're supposed to be goaded. Die, lizard! Dude, Melon, you've lost your mind. I got reptile leather. I don't really think that's a thing, but okay. Sonny, for my first question, out of all the animals in the zoo, which one have you morphed into? Bro, that's basically cheating. Nah, it isn't, dude. I still gotta look through all those animals. This is gonna be annoying. All right, fine. I disguised myself as my true form. The goat! Oh my god, there's so many goats. I gotta kill them all. No, wait, what? Why would you kill the goats, bro? Because I have no choice. Melon, you've lost the plot. Guys, comment down below. Save the goats. Save the world. Uh, this goat right here is looking a little sus. Oh, 
guys. He thinks he's on to me, but he's not even close to this exhibit. That's not him. This one's sunny. That's not sunny. That's not sunny either. That one's not sunny. Dang it, I've checked so many goats. None of them are you. I'll give you a free hint. Where I'm at, it's very noisy. Bro, everywhere is noisy. Wait, oh no, those are lions. Rawr. Bro, what? Which one are you? I am the goat with the sauce. The goat with the sauce. I'm the goat with the sauce. Yeah, boy. Oy. That's gonna be my new hit song. It's gonna be like a top 10 right there next to Bieber. Okay, Sonny, second question. Which exhibit are you closest to? I'm closest to... Oh, the giraffes. The giraffes? Yeah. What the heck? I'm not even anywhere near the giraffes. Good, good, good. Let's keep it that way. Guys, I gotta move. I said I was closest to the giraffes, which was true, but now I'm gonna move closer to the elephants. Please protect me. Be the shield. Be the shield wall. Those are the gorillas. Hmm. Oh, I found the giraffes. Yo. Yo, guys, he's getting closer. This is not good. There's also elephants in here. <gasps> Don't see a singular goat. What? This is good. Yeah, there's no goats anywhere near those giraffes. What? Is there a goat in here somewhere? I only speak the truth because I am goaded. Yo, guys, this looks kind of sus. I'm uh, low-key like in this elephant's bum. All right, I'm gonna whack this elephant and... <gasps> Do I have to kill you, elephant? You really want to fight back? You don't want to smoke, dude. Kill them, elephants. Kill the melon. He can't. They can't do nothing to me. That elephant literally didn't fight back. I actually kind of thought it was going to kill me, but it just, like, let itself die. Hey, you can't even hit me. But there's no goats in here. You're not even in this exhibit. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Why are you being so... Wait, wait. No, no. Wait, get back here. No, 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 melon. We can talk about this. We can talk about this. Remember, if you want to be goaded, you should never hurt a goat. Well, that's true, but you're a fake goat. You're a foat. I am not a foat, bro. I am the real G with the goat. Ow! Let's go! Big man Sonny was slain by the bigger man Melon. Bruh, you are a cringe lord for that one. Okay, Sonny, it's my turn to hide. So I'm gonna give you this sword right here. Uh, just let me give you one more hit. Oh, thanks, bro. That was really nice of you. You can have that too, that, some of that leather. Yo, chill! And now I absorb the Melon soul. No! I'm out of here. I'm gonna go hide. I got two minutes. That's right. One ugly Melon, two beautiful sunnies, three intelligent sunnies, and four really dumb melons. Sorry, am I counting out loud again? Five, six, seventeen. Shut up, sunny! Twenty-nine brains is what melon doesn't have. Thirty brains is what sunny has. Okay, guys, for this round, I'm gonna become a water animal. This is the last place sunny will ever suspect. So, I'm just gonna enter in with the sharks. Hopefully, they don't kill me. Um, there's barrier blocks here, so I'm gonna have to go in from above. Just fly up here, break a hole, and then I just have to morph myself into a shark. So, oh my god, oh my god, where's the hole? Where's the hole? Where's the hole? All I do is do is type a little command, slash morph, big man melon. Morph myself into a shark! Wait, I'm still drowning because I'm a player. Wait, give me air, give me air. No, no, I'm gonna drown. Uh, 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 what do I do? What do I do? Wait, I'm regenerating health in a quick enough time. Hold on, I'm just gonna place a little bit of an air bubble back here for myself and then place the door down. Now when I go back here, no, I still can't even get in. No! Yo, guys, I'm making two new weapons, the melon slapper and my second weapon is the melon destroyer. This is how I'll get air. I'll go over this magma cube and shuck up some bubbles. Shani will never know. All right, Sonny, I'm ready when Ever. That's perfect timing because my Melon Destroyer and Slapper are prepared. Yes, you're so going down. Now, my first question I have to ask because I refuse to hurt one of these beautiful creatures. Are you morphed as a goat? I am not morphed as a goat, Sonny. Good. Now, I'm just going to pet the little goat. So cute. Look at this little guy right here. He's the best. He's the goat. <laughs> now, Melon, for my first real question, because that totally shouldn't have counted. It's gonna be, are you close to the center counting zone or really far on the outskirts? I'm definitely closer to the outskirts, that's for sure. Okay. Yo, I bet Melon's one of these bears. That seems like the type of animal you'd become because they're kind of cute, cuddly, but you also think you're the biggest and the baddest, which you're not, so you would totally be a bear. Bang! Mm. 
that's not you. How about this one? Nope, that's also not you. I feel kind of bad about this. Um, Melon, I'm just gonna ask, are you a small or large animal? I would say I'm a pretty large animal. Wait, then you could be one of these bears, except you're not freaking out as I kill them. Uh, you probably shouldn't attack a bear, Sonny. It might hit you back and it might hurt. These are really friendly bears. I don't know why, but they just are so cuddly and they don't do anything except let me kill them. What did he draw? Yo, I got a bear head. I can't wear it though. That would have been so epic. I'll at least hold it and honor this bear. Sonny, you only got two minutes left and you haven't even gotten anywhere near me yet. Yo, chill. That's Cap. I have at least two minutes and ten seconds. You know what's Cap? You. You're Cap, Sonny. You're Cap. Dude, I only have one question left. I've got to be careful and very big brained about it. I need to explore a little bit more first. Once I have a minute left, I'll probably ask a question. Yo, they got Harambe back here? Monkas. I like monkas. Yo, Melon. <laughs> I think I found you, bro. What do you mean? There's an army of gorillas and then one random little seal in there. No, that's not me, Sonny. I don't know what you're talking about. From the top turnbuckle. Boom. Wait, it actually wasn't you. <laughs> you really thought I'd be a seal, Sonny? I eat seal. Uh, what? You eat seal? You eat seals. No, I don't eat seals. Honey. I heard that, bro. But I actually got to say something really weird. I might be the king of the jungle, bro. All these gorillas are following me around. Maybe I'm part ape. I'm kind of the goat, you know? These monkeys love me. Well, Sonny, you can bring all the monkeys in the world you want, and I'll still destroy you. Because my morph is so overpowered and strong. Yeah, you think so, bro? Gorilla army, let's roll out. Yo, I don't know why they like me so much. This is awesome, though. Okay, now where should we go? He says he eats seals, so he's probably in a water environment. But there's nothing in this. You only got a minute left, Sonny. Yo, what is this? Bro, Melon, I just found something kind of crazy. What'd you find? I don't think I should tell you about it, dude. It's just for my knowledge. Come on, monkeys, let's roll. Bro, you're being sus, dude. Where are the water cages? Yo, I see one. There's a huge aquarium back here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Goat mode, roll out. Oh, my monkeys are gone. They were too slow. Oh, well. Melon, I bet you're one of these sharks, bro. You only got 30 seconds left, Sonny. The melon slapper's ready. Wait, how do I even get in there? There's barrier blocks. I gotta break in from the sides. Wait, it's covered up. What the heck, bro? Where's the entrance? Where's the entrance? Yes, I found a ladder. Let's go, let's go. We gotta get to the top and jump in, please. I will destroy you, melon. Please, please. Yes, there's a way in. Yo, Melon, I'm in here. Wait. Oh, I thought they were going to attack me. These are the friendliest, cutest, most adorablest sharks ever. Yeah, bro, the sharks are kind of nice. Whack them. No. Don't hurt my brothers. You only got 30 seconds left. Yeah, hey, your brothers won't be lasting too long, Melon. Are you this one with the big nose? Ugh. Come on, hit him. This big one. Maybe this big one. You're drowning, Sonny. It's fine. I don't need much more time. I just gotta find and eliminate you. Which one of these is moving weird? Wait, 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 wait. There's gotta be air in here somewhere. This one. No. I can get one more. No. <laughs> Thanks for the XP, buddy. How is that even possible, bro? I can't swim in there. I literally drowned. Sonny, you got 10 seconds left. Bro, that's enough time. I need to get my axe. Wait, no. Where is it? I need my axe. It's gotta be here somewhere. Yes, I got it. And I see you. That's you getting oxygen. No, what are you talking about? Hit him. Yes. Oh. Bro, that was a photo finish. I had like less than two seconds. Oh, wait. No, I'm gonna drown. Melon, I need the air. I need bubbles. Ow, ow, now the magma's killing me. Melon, no! You know what sucked about that round, though? I wanted to show you the melon slapper. If you wouldn't mind just standing right here. Oh, uh, yeah, let me see it. Boom! Nice one. Boom! Nice one. No! Oh my god, two hearts. Two hearts. Bro, how much knockback is on that? 100. Bro. All right, Sonny, you got two minutes left. And I'll let you know, I'm crafting up a special weapon for you this year. Yeah, is it perhaps the melon destroyer? There you go, have fun. I'm out of here! I don't need no melon destroyer. I'm gonna actually just rename his thing into Supernova Exploder Sundai. That's a pretty good name, I think, for my axe. Okay, guys, I'm gonna do something so <laughs> troll. I'm gonna morph myself into one of these little tiny crabs right Right here. And then I will be right at the starting area. Melon will never suspect a thing. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. Whoa, that was fast, dude. 
dude. Where the heck are you hiding? I bet you you're somewhere near the spawn. And Sunny, luckily I have a weapon that is so powerful I can one-shot everything. I'm killing all the animals. I'm a fruit. Chill. I'm a fruit. Chill. I'm gonna stand up for fruit guy. Yo, you need to relax, Melon, bruh. You're losing your mind. Die. Dude, dude, what are you hurting right now? Everything. This seal, you're dead. This other goat, you're also dead. What else can I hurt? Goat. You're goat, so you're okay. Oh, you're dead. Yo, Melon, relax, dude. You're scaring me. Die! 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 I'm going over to the bear exhibit. Die! One shot it! One shot it! One shot it! Going crazy, Sonny! I'm going crazy! Can I put this bear head on? No, I can't. Sonny, for my first wait a second. Yo, guys, Melon's actually losing his mind right now. He's attacking so many innocent animals. I think he's over here near the bear exhibit. I'm trying to sneak my way in. Give me this monkey meat! Yo, guys! I'm so scared. You trying to attack me, gorillas? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna just one-shot all of you. I'm gonna kill your brothers and your sisters. Guys, he's going absolutely insane. He killed so many of these bears. He won't expect me to be back here now. I've just got to quickly morph. Hey, giraffes. Die! Oh, these giraffes are gonna actually take a hit. What about these elves? Yo, guys, I just morphed all players into black bears, so I wonder if Melon's gonna realize he transformed into the very animal he was trying to kill. Why do I have more hearts? And why do I feel lower to the- Yo, why am I a bear? What? <laughs> Yo, guys, I'm gonna keep morphing Melon into different animals. No, check this. Check this one. I'm gonna turn him in to a snake. Yo, I'm a snake now. Whoa, whoa. These snakes have so much health. What? Yo, this is kind of OP. Die. And I one-shot people. It makes sense because I'm poisonous. Melon, you only have three minutes left, bro. You need to chill out and start asking questions. Okay, okay. For my first question, Sonny, um, which um, 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 I'm trying to think still. Uh, are you inside or are you outside? I'm, uh, I'm outside. You're, uh, you're outside, huh? Yeah. Okay, second question. Which animal are you morphed into? I morphed into a bear. You need to chill. Wait, bear. Bear. I'm coming for you. Yo, guys, Melon's coming to kill me, but I'm gonna turn him into a firefly. He's gonna be so tiny. Yo, what the heck? I have one health and I'm so small. Can I at least fly? What am I, bro? I'm like a little fly thing. Am I a firefly? Where are these bears? I lost track of them. I'm turning him into a ladybug. This is so funny. Bro, I'm a ladybug now. I'm so tiny. I can't even fly. No. Hey, Melon. Hey, Melon. I know I'm supposed to be the hider and you're supposed to be the one asking the questions, but I I wonder, what's your favorite animal? Uh, like, uh, eagle. You're dumb, bro. It's the goat. Everyone knows we both like goats. But my real question is, what's your least favorite animal? Like, what animal do you absolutely hate the most? Um, wait, is this the bear exhibit? No! <laughs> Yo, you splattered like a bug. Oh my god, I am so low on health. It's so hard to do this parkour. No, with the crabs, I'm gonna drown. I'm a little ladybug. Dude, I hate crabs. Really? Really? That's interesting. Take a look at yourself. No, Sonny, stop. Are you morphing me into all these animals? Yeah, dude. And now you're a crab. One of the nastiest animals ever. Bro, no. Oh, do I get out of here? Guys, I'm making a run for it. This black bear will survive no matter what. I've just got to find a more secure exhibit or climb this ladder and hide out on the aquarium roof. Except I'm a bit large to climb the ladder. This is, this is not going very well. Uh. Yeah, I didn't think this through. Going back to the bear exhibit. And I'm gonna slaughter them all. That's it. We're gonna become armadillos. Bro, I got so much HP. I'm an armadillo. Bruh, I'm literally a little rock, this though. Are you this bear? I thought you said you were morphed into a bear. I was morphed into a bear, bruh, but now I'm camouflaged perfectly. What do you mean? You're an armadillo? Yo, look at you. You're a little rock running around. You can see me right now? Yeah, boy. What the heck? Where are you? I'm camouflaged. That's all I'll tell you. And I'm the same morph as you. Are you in the bear exhibit right now? That's my last question. No, bro. You're you're in the bear exhibit right now. What the heck? How can you see? Wait a second. There's stone right around us. Yo, chill. He said he's camouflaged. You can't see me, bro. What do you mean I can't see you? I'm goat mode right now, dude. I can see the whole world from up here. Oh, wait. I mean, I can see you from the brick wall that I'm hiding on. Oh, there's ladders over on this aquarium. You have 30 seconds. Yo, I just gotta climb these ladders. Where are you? Yo, get back here, yo. 
armadillo. No, I'm not an armadillo. I am the goat. You'll never get me alive. Get back here. Wait, Melon, think about it. You're also a goat. Goats don't hurt goats. You're right, but there can only be one goat, Sonny. And that's me. Oh my goodness. What? Supernova Exploder Sundai? Yes, don't you like my name? That is one of the coolest names I've ever heard, Melon. Thank you, bro. It took me a while to come up with it. I'll give you credit. That was a really good job, bro. You found me and you killed me with one of the coolest Ooh. weapons of- You don't need to kill me twice, bro. Sorry, sorry, bro. Sorry. Kill you three times. No, don't hit- <sighs> I was gonna give you props, but you've ruined it. Just go and hide. You're so annoying. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm leaving. I'm out of here. You have two minutes minus 10 seconds for killing me. So you have one minute and 20 seconds, according to my math. Okay, guys. Last round, Sonny was cheating by changing animals. But there's something he doesn't know about this map that I do. If I get myself some goggles of true vision, grab these, put them on. I'm pretty sure there's some secrets on this map involving ghost blocks. Check this out. Okay, it's somewhere around here. I'm pretty sure. Yo, check it out, bro. Look at these ghost blocks. Go through here. Yo, what? Bro, I can actually escape. Wait, 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 wait. What is all of this? Dude, I can actually escape. Open up these doors. Let me out of here. I'm escaping the zoo. Yo, this is sick. This is like penguins from Madagascar. Open up these doors. Yo, I'm in the sewer system. Yo, wait. I hop up here. What's this way? I can't, I can't see, but I'm pretty sure. If I go down further in this sewer, that's the penguin's base. That's sick. It is. This is the zoo from Madagascar. Fountain zoo entrance. Lake. Where do I want to go? Yo, I kind of want to check out the lake. Run down here. In the sewers. Yo, what? This is sick. Come on. Push through the water. Yo, I actually escaped the zoo. This is crazy. There's only one animal that I should become then. Slash morph. And now I become a penguin. Penguin. Yo, check me out. I'm an actual penguin. And now I escape. I saw a little base down here that I could hide in. Yo, right here. It's a submarine. Let's go. Oh, that's so sick. If I open up this hatch. Yo, I'm literally in a submarine right now. Sonny's never gonna find me. This is so sick. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Let's do this, bro. Final round. It's time for me to... Sniff you out, bruh. I'm gonna have to morph into the ultimate animal. Morph, sunny, pig. Wait, maybe there's a cooler pig. Let me see. Let's go! Now this is a good wild truffle pig, bruh. I'm a boar! And I'm gonna come and bore you to death with my axe. That actually sounds pretty exciting. Not boring at all. So the question is, Melon, where did you go to hide today? Which exhibit? Oh, wait. I bet you went to the cafeteria. You sounded pretty hungry earlier, bruh. Let me see if I can break my way in here. Open up! Oh, there's just more bricks back here. Is there even a way into this building? That might just be for the zookeepers. Huh. Where are you, bruh? Sonny, don't you worry about it. I might be doing something a little bit cheeky this round. That's all I'm gonna say. Wait, 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 wait. Then I gotta ask you a question. Are you even in the map? Like, what do you mean cheeky? Uh, no, I'm not in the map. What? Okay, okay. Well, define map, define map. The zoo. Are you in the zoo? No, I'm not in the zoo. What the heck, bro? Wait. Wait, I see the whole cityscape out here. Yo, 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 yo. You left and went into the city? Dude, I never said I went into the city. Wait, then where could you have possibly gone? Maybe I went into the city, I don't know. Bruh, I need to use my galaxy brain and remember the shows. What happened in Madagascar? What were the penguins always doing? I know they were causing trouble. I think they found a way to break out, but I can't remember how. Melon, how did the penguins break out? Uh, why are you asking that question, Sonny? You don't even know if I'm a penguin. It doesn't matter if you're a penguin. You're probably using their secret escape method, which I don't think is this. I literally just walked out of the main entrance. I'm pretty sure that's not how they did it. Okay, dude, grab the goggles of true vision and go to the spawn area. Okay, okay, okay. True vision goggles. Equip it. Yo, I'm a boar with true vision goggles. You can't even see them, but I'm sure they look cool. Yo, what the heck is that, Melon? There's some secret blocks near the crabs. That's all I'm telling you, Sonny, you're out of questions. I'm going in. Dude, this is how they got out of the zoo. I need to unmorph. I need to demorph. 
D morph D morph D morph and now I am the goat the sunny boy How did they get out though? Which way this is like the zookeeper secret tunnels and then the penguins use this to escape through the sewers Yes, it worked. I remembered Come on melon is out here somewhere, but where bro? There's a ladder wait Yo, I wonder if this connects to the fountain that I saw earlier, but which way do I want to go zoo entrance and fountain? It does connect to the fountain. I knew there was a secret spot there, but that's not what I want I need to find some other way out out of here. You got one minute left, Sonny. That should be plenty of time. I've got to jump more quickly with it. Come on, come on, come on, Melon. Yo, what is this? I just got to the end of the sewers and I'm going inside of something. Yo, what? Melon, my next question is what did I just find? Explain this to me, please. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I can't really see your screen, Sonny. Dude, I just exited the sewer pipe and there's an underwater boat. What is this? Uh, I gotta move, guys. I gotta move. Dude, it's a submarine. This looks epic. Come on. You're probably in here. I'm in. See you, Sonny. Yo, that's you. I'm out of here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Swim, swim, swim. Go into swimming mode. What are you doing, son? That's it. Let's go. Swim. We can catch this penguin. I gotta waddle away. Where did he go? Find another body of water, please. Which direction did he just go? On. Yo, Melon, I see you, bro. You look so goofy. Get over here. Yo, chill out, Sonny. Chill out. He's on my tail. Oh, God. Why are you so quick? You're a penguin. You should be waddling. Where do I go? I gotta find some place to hide. There's nowhere left to hide, Melon. All you can do is run and delay the inevitable. No, I'm running into a wall. There he is. You're back at the city and you're a dead man now. I just gotta find the front entrance, please. Dude, you look so so goofy. You can't catch me, Sonny. You can't catch me. You want to bet? No, I stopped sprinting. That's right. I'm going to break those legs with this axe. You're so close. One more mistake and you're done. Run in this straight line. Boom. I'm good. I'm good. No, no, no. I'm going to unplug your mouse. Take this. No, no, no. <sighs> I got to smack him. I unplugged his mouse, guys. Bro, thanks for the food. What? That was supposed to kill you. You used the knockback one. That's it, Melon. I'm done with your shenanigans. Uh-oh, what are you doing, Shiny? Morphing the big man Melon into a colossal squid. No, what the heck? You're so slow now. Just gotta catch this big ugly squid. Where do I go? Your head is so flat when you turn around. Maybe if he uses the wrong one. Boom! No! I've got him cornered. Where's the entrance to the zoo? You're never going back in there. No! I'm gone, Sonny. You can't catch me. No, I could totally catch you, bro. You're so slow as this guy. Get on the wall. No! Stop it, Sonny. Stop it. You know what? I realize it's okay. I found you, so I won. I don't even need to kill you, bro. It's all good. It's all good. That is true. But, um, uh, so you can let me live? Yeah, you can live, because I won, which means I'm goat mode. Whatever, bro. It was close. I won't lie.